Hey folks, uh, hello. I hadn't recorded anything uh, in a while, but I decided to record something today regarding grieving uh, because it, it is my mom's uh, birthday today. And she passed away about 10 years ago, roughly, um, actually 12 years now. And, uh, you know, one of the things that, that happened as a result of my son's passing away about nine months ago is the fact that I can feel more um, pain, if you will. I, I never really felt, you know, the, uh, the feeling of pain in my heart uh, uh, from my mom's passing. I was in, a, at the time I was drinking, I was an alcoholic. And I think I, you know, I used alcohol to numb my pain. So I don't connect that uh, with my mom's passing until now that I have this uh, deep wound from the passing of my son, who uh, you see his picture up there on the on this uh, uh, cabinet that I have behind me. That's my son, Will. And because of his passing, I can now feel that pain. And, you know, I couldn't feel that before. And I thought, that's weird, you know, I don't feel that. But now is kind of a blessing because I don't feel, I mean, I feel bad when I feel the pain, but I actually feel good because, you know, you got to feel the pain. It's like missing out on a flavor. You know, it's like having a pizza and you don't feel the taste or having something that you love, some food that, and you can't taste the flavor, but that's how I felt. I felt numb to the uh, grieving process. Uh, and, and now, I feel more connected to her, to my mom, and uh, I feel more real, more human, and more awake, if you will, spiritually, as a result of this. So thank you, Will. Thank you, Mom. I love you. And for all of you who are feeling this pain, I know it, pain is not fun, but it is part of being human and part of being real and whole and, and healthy. Uh, to feel the whole rainbow of emotions and uh, I'm blessed to have that be able to feel that today and moving forward in uh, a point uh, here of reflection it's been about I guess uh, eight months almost nine months now since my son passed away and it is getting easier uh, I do have uh, grief panic attacks from time to time and by that I mean, you know, more of a of a pain um, attack um, from grieving that I get, you know, from time to time. But that seems to be, you know, um, subsiding somewhat. And the the way that I deal with that pain now is I do uh, what's called the Honopono technique that is out there on the web. If you look it up, uh, Honopono, and and what you do is that. You say uh, four things. You say, uh, forgive me, I'm sorry, thank you, and I love you. And I just chant the, those four phrases over and over again and holding that person in my heart and holding them in, in, in an embrace and in a hugging way. And by reciting those four phrases, I get, I, I feel the pain and I feel, and I say those phrases and I, and I become at peace with it and then it goes away you know it subsides and it goes through me it goes through me and I feel good about it afterwards and I don't feel like my energy sucked out of myself or I feel energized afterwards and I, I bid you to try it it's called the Honopono something like that Honopono uh, technique uh, it's out there on the web it's, it comes from Hawaii so peace and love to you all. God bless. Thank you for listening to me. And I, I bid you well and peace and love. Bye.